Hey, welcome everybody to Battle Pirates Crib. Um, I put your screen share up. I'm going to remove it and then add it back in. It's just showing up as black. Okay. Is it loading in? Uh, no, for some reason. Let me just uh, stop and try again. Hang on. Let's see what's happening there. Okay. Try that. There we go. Now it looks like it's working. There we go. Right. Cool. Sorry about that, everybody. Uh, so uh, we're going to talk about the FM, the new FM target, which I'm surprised by, pleased by, whatever words you want to use. Uh, it's not a good auto target from what Kraken Doc told me. It took him seven hours to auto it, but I've run it through like four or five times and getting zero damage each time and we may have fred show up even though he's convinced he can't do these targets with the uh arc i think fred's gonna be able to do it i i really uh i really have uh high hopes for this so how are you doing tsm yeah all good not too bad um things have stabled now here so um the yeah, office is set up it's looking nice and clean and tidy everything else in the house is unpacked so um yeah i'm back on full steam Okay, so uh, where are you from, Eric? Where you have to uh, translate from Canadian to English? Okay. Easy said and done. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So uh, yeah. All right. Uh, let's move forward. Uh, nothing with bug fixes, so let's keep on moving. All right. Um, I didn't uh, capture everything associated with the mega weekend um are you taking the uh, are you taking the weekend off just to do all the the mega campaigns which we're not really no. going to talk about so no. <laughs> for some reason this weekend there's three mega campaigns that you can do um, i don't even know what this is about yeah what's that all about like what why would you do this are people requesting it somewhere like oh i want to do my megas and i'm like Anytime somebody hits my mega, I'm like, wow, you need, to, you need to, like a new hobby. Well, yeah, they they need, yeah, they need that bit of their life back again because it's pointless. <laughs> <laughs> I don't quite get it. Yeah, I'm like, why are you hitting my mega? I mean, I haven't updated my mega in like three years, and you're still running over. You know, I'm fine with that. You, you can do whatever with my mega. I can't delete it. But like, what? Why are you even doing this? I mean, it, it's used to, just, it used to be the case that people used to hit the mega when they used to fail in your base, and they go, "Well, I'm really frustrated, so I'm going to go hit that instead." But now it's almost easier to hit a base than it is to hit a mega. <laughs> so, just uh, you know, yeah, I don't understand it. I don't, I don't get it. Um, but they're running a whole weekend for those people. So, uh, yeah, if you want to get your megas all uh, primed up, you're all, you're all good. Oh, uh, well, uh, okay. Oh, you're doing it this weekend, so you can't show them off on the Friday show, Fred. <laughs> I, I'm curious. Uh, are you going with like uh, the French tips, or I, I'm curious what's what's going on there? So uh, we'll we'll see. Maybe on Friday, but he said this weekend what Fred's going to do with his nails. Uh, right now, we are in the week of uh, August 14th through the 20th, the second stanza here. Um, we have a new Forsaken mission. We're going to talk about the target associated with that. Friday, we're going to talk about we, uh, VXP Weekend. Legion's Finest, I have not hit yet because I was going to try and hit that, but then they dropped the strategy guide, so I lost I lost some time as far as looking at these uh, arc targets. And we're going to talk more about that. Um, and then yada, yada, yada. Um, and then Bounty next week and uh running wild for the rampage and the following week we have pillage do we think we're gonna get the uh uh the flag for the terrari i think the point but yeah we might do it's um no it's september should be due shouldn't it so yeah, in fact, no, if it turns up, then, yeah, but if it turns up, then we might get it, yeah, built for, yeah, so it probably will be then, yeah, yeah, be about right, actually. Yeah, that, or 
I'm not really sure what they're going to drop in this upcoming no, I think the flagship, shouldn't it? Yeah, and probably X1. Or no, sorry, um, you want you want you want to three maybe. Yeah, you want to three in the flag probably. I'm guessing. Flag for the okay. Flag for the rampage and pillage. I okay. Um. All right, and uh, terror transformation for the contagion, um, and then some other stuff. Anything else that's uh, big in this August calendar? Um, no, obviously it's quite nice that obviously they put the horror TLC back in again because that's really helpful. Um, horrors definitely are doing um, are worth having. I just wish they would have U one upgrade now because they definitely need it. But, um, and maybe that might come as well in pillage. A U one upgrade for a defender would be nice. Yeah, sister should be fun. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> oh, you have plans for him and Sisley? I want to have Well, he, he's gonna be away. He's gonna be away for two weeks. Ah, right. Uh, okay, he's gonna be in Sicily. All right. Hey, Lego. <laughs> yeah, he's got home in time. Yeah, he wants he wants to see uh, us run through the uh, uh, the new FM target. I'm I'm guessing. All right. So. Okay. So, because um, he saw me uh, posting my uh, screenshots from my my blood screen associated with it, and saw the, the zero damage, so I'm sure I'm certain we could be able to run through that. And, and if uh, everybody thinks your driving is too good, we'll have Fred do it as well. So we'll, we'll go for there. All right. Uh, if nothing else in the calendar, let's move forward. All right, Legion's finest. I've not tried this yet. Um, this is for your Terrari. Um, you get uh, uh, one, two, three, eight days of uh, build tokens, five of the lim limited Pillium MK2 rockets, uh, five armors. Um, but the big question at the end of the show you're going to ask is like, what's the fucking point of owning any upgrades on your Terrari? Um, Mm. And uh, do you get drawn in the, into the trap at this point where you're like, I don't need to do anything with mine. They are perfectly fine at this point. At least that's my thought. So the TLC is the previous ARC uh, FM targets? Yes, I'm assuming. I, I have yeah, not it is. Those. I've just gone into one. <laughs> okay. okay, okay. I'll just have a quick peek of one just to double check. So the very first one is the very first target that ever turned up for the FM. Okay. All right, um, but I, I would recommend doing this, and but it doesn't seem to make sense because, as you'll see uh, throughout the show, as long as you have twelve gales on your Terrari, you don't need upgraded rockets. You don't need anything else. Um, there's really no reason to put armor on them. I, I mean, but I feel like I'm walking to, into a trap if I do that. So more mm. my thought is you you need to do this just to be afraid enough that they're going to do something that's going to change the current meta in the game. And, and that's the worrying thing, isn't it? Because at the moment, yeah. you know, it's almost like quite an enjoyable FM cycle again. Which is quite a chilled version, to be honest. It's quite they are quite chilled out targets. Yeah, yeah. Um, so let's move forward. Yep. All right, this is a strategy guy for siege. Uh, the primal railgun creates opportunities to hit turrets faster, reach tricky fuel silos for a burst of damage, and deal damage to multiple targets once through its pierce its range is represented by the blue ring around the rampage so he has a 50 percent range extender uh click click once yeah all right um the magnus strike cannon is the limited weapon has a range of 60 with an increase of 50 depending on which um 
Canon um, range extender you're using. So it's 60 versus 70, and it has a pierce range of 105. Mm, it's a lot, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. So I'm looking forward to this, unless they fuck it up, because you could find the right angle to take yeah. advantage of that pierce range. Yeah, I agree. I like, yeah. it. I like it when they put fun things in. Yeah, me too. Yeah, we can definitely see some options with that. Yeah, yeah. So we see the targets on Friday. We'll have another show on Friday where we'll discuss this. Uh, as far as what the implications are, so uh, yeah, but I can do another picture as well. I'll do a, I'll do a target breakdown for the VXP as well. Okay, so so what what colors are you going to use? Well, it's going to be red and something or other, isn't it? Because it's a, it's all it's all um, you know reverse now. I don't know. We'll okay, see. Well, 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 you did Ukraine colors at one point, so you I know, did. Just, what, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm just curious, I might actually but... do something for the. Um, the lionesses because they're in the finals now for the uh, ladies world cup so. okay yeah yeah the the u.s is that no longer in that ladies world cup thing i think it's us v spain i think for the final i think i think, I think that's what it is oh, no. yeah so um yeah it has an additional range and the pierce so this is going to be something that you really need to pay attention to once we start to see these targets and people that have full built ships, you know, try and engage the VXP targets. I'm not going to be one of those people. Um, but it looks interesting with, with this uh, range differential and the Pierce that there's possibilities for the target at the end of the day. Yeah, it, I did notice that it's going to be quite a difference on the reload, as you said, because obviously one's spread out over quite a period of time, and this one's got a, a fixed reload of eight seconds. So um, if you're going to use it, make sure you do it accurately first time otherwise it's going to be a quite a wait before it kicks off again yeah because it's not re affected by reload bonuses so mm. <coughs> as you said uh the reload time is five which can be decreased by on the magna strike cannon which can be yeah. reduced by ranking that's going to take it just getting a skull takes it down to 1.25 <coughs> And then, um, but on the right hand side with the, uh, I'm sorry, on the left hand side with the salvo of 15, it's going to be 0.2 seconds for each one of those salvos after the first one. So it's going to be uh, seven, two point, no, seven times, uh, it's going to be 1.4 seconds. Yeah. No, 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 no. Four, yeah, yeah, 0 0.2, 14 times 0 0.2. So yeah. Um, but the big thing is the greater range and the pierce range. Yeah, two point eight. So, um, so it's yeah. nearly going to do three lots of reload before the built-in is going to fire again. Not quite, but nearly. Yeah, and that different of range, that difference in range, because that range is going to the range of sixty. Um, times 1.60 is going to go to 90 and then 70 is going to go to um, 105 so there's going to be a 15 difference in range between the two of them yeah so it'll be interesting to see what they've got their range is set at um for their medium range stuff not their short range stuff so it'll yeah. be interesting so um so reload not affected as far as the built-in primal gun not affected by reload bonuses uh, that also includes not just you know specials and whatnot but it includes sculling and crews and whatnot none of those hmm. should in theory affect that no not affected so, by reload bonuses yes exactly that it'll be fixed at eight seconds should so, be fixed at eight seconds okay um let's uh Huh? Yeah, we're okay. It's not, yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, the Scourge Launcher. Um, medium range, da da da. No countermeasures. Uh, has a minimum range. Uh, and King the, Killer. Yeah. Yeah. High with the short. So you can, I'm assuming he's going to have a fairly long reload. So you can get. You know, we'll know, know more on Friday, so you can sneak up and get inside the minimum range, if that makes sense. But it does have King Killer. Um, 
and it's accuracy based. Um, accuracy is medium, which means that a vage should work. And, and it's going to be important as well because look, it says there splash is low, but only get it from the shockwave effect. So if you can prevent the shockwave effect, you shouldn't get any splash. So yeah, let's look at the armor. I mean, we haven't seen it yet, but I want to see what the armor points are for the flagship. And if the flagship's got a higher armor points, then evade the shit out of that hole. Basically, get it right out there as maximum possible. Yeah, because I think this will be the turret that'll be the annoying one that'll cause you area effect. You know, the total effect on your you're gonna have an imbalance of damage anyway with this with this turret already. Yeah, and shock waves have a splash of up twenty. Have we ever quantified what the splash is from a, a shock wave? It feels like it's about twenty. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, but but we always stack nowadays anyway, so you know you don't do the drag 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 trail stuff anymore, do we? So, well, yeah, we should bring some stuff back, but yeah, um. But the fact that it's confirmed that it's King Killer and the fact, the fact that it's obviously, you know, it's it's a medium range one and straight away that just tells me you're going to need a massive, a, a ship that's got slightly more um, armor points than the others. And you can do that various ways by putting a random weapon on that can weigh a little bit of weight. But um, yeah, flagship already is indicating that it needs to be a huge evade on it just so that it, this doesn't get the opportunity to do shockwave and even if it does chip away a little bit and take some hits, then um, at least you're not getting damage across the whole fleet, hopefully. But um, we'll see what the rest of the turrets are first. Okay. Yeah, move forward. All right. Uh, I'm hoping this doesn't really fit the the, the discussion of a railgun. Because a railgun is known as a weapon that has a... It's known for its projectile speed. I mean, in the real world and whatnot, it's not accuracy based. It's got a high range, high damage, high health. Usually, um, dumb fire it, though, yeah. But dumb fire, but you know, the world, the word railgun means it's. You don't need to put an explosive in that projectile. It's just doing the damage associated with the you know, um, speed times mass. Mm -hmm. You know, so it's a very fast weapon. I'm assuming by looking at, at what they chose to use as the representation of it, it's not going to have a very fast, uh, a very high projectile speed. Yeah, because otherwise well, it doesn't make yeah. sense. And it also has splash as well, but not much of it. So this is indicating to that really high speed fleet we were talking about as well, doesn't it? If it is done fire. Yeah, it's done fire and. I think the word railgun is the only issue I have. And uh, to the creator of this strategy guide, much better on the uh, the quality of the uh, snapshots, the, the screenshots that you provided. Because mm -hmm. before, you know, I had to make my own because they, you couldn't even tell what they are. They're not, they're not wonderful, but they they're a vast improvement. I, I do appreciate. It. So I didn't have to go back and screenshot everything to uh so people could actually see what you know not like last month's or last strategy guide where yeah we've seen this railgun before haven't we though so if it's the same it's it's not a railgun it's not i mean you're gonna go through this and be like okay that's a, it looks more like a mortar uh and you're gonna see this throughout where it's like oh that's not what we thought it was and that that's one of the things i wonder about with this whole thing is sort of like some people don't it feels like some people don't know the plots that is a game designer because I think this is a, originally a mortar. It's not. A, it doesn't look like a railgun. It's shooting up in the air. But whatever. Yeah, well, yeah. I just remember it was an area effect dumbfire weapon previously. So, so yeah. Anyway, just go back two seconds. So we've got a one times radioactive, one times ballistic. Okay, so that there'll probably be just two or three of these, you know, in the top. And, and generally, these pop up quite late, don't they? And um, if I remember rightly, the turrets pop up first and these pop up a little bit later. Well, they have been. I think it was tier nine we were doing this sort of stuff. So. Yeah. And, you know, I don't, as I recall, we don't have any countermeasures uh, no. slots available. So, you know, no, countermeasures, no vulnerability is NA. So, yeah. Uh, but at least it's not a uh, king killer no. because it doesn't have any accuracy. 
not like last time where we had King Killer with um Well that didn't no make action. sense. Yeah, it didn't yeah, make, it didn't make sense. sense and yeah. And so it didn't it was, actually work that way either. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was uh yeah. So um uh, all right, let's move forward. All right. Uh Scourge Cannon. Again, no accuracy, splash low, uh medium damage, range medium. They said earlier the range of our ship is medium, so I'm not sure if you can outrange this. Um, normally, it was sort of conflicting. Uh, if the range, yeah, we'll we'll have to see on Friday. Uh, Friday show, we'll we'll get into that. Again, no countermeasure. Um, you know, we've seen this before. It's the blunderbuss, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly that. And just looking at projectile speed there, yeah, so yeah. Hmm. It was outrunnable. You could outrun it in a straight line before. So we'll see yeah, how this works we'll see out. What happens. So that's, that's too ballistic anyway. So. Yeah. So let's move forward. Another ballistic. Yeah. Um, and this was originally the, the picture of it that originally was concussive. That that turret, right? Yeah, yeah, very much so. It might, and it might just be a, you know, a, a a marker for the turret. It might change that to the actual event. That's how. But why would they put it in this strategy guy? Well, yeah, whatever. Uh, damage low, accuracy medium, range high. Again, another one you can go into. So all this stuff so far is screaming fast ship. Yeah, two king killers now. That's the second king killer turret. Yeah, with one rad and one one ballistic. So yeah. So high accuracy oops. though, yeah. Again, I think you can outrun it. Yeah. Well, me accuracy is medium. Yeah, but I mean, it's still, it's still. I think, I think it's going to be done fire just by the very ranges. No, 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 no. It has no it. splash. No, no, it doesn't actually. No, no. Fair point. Yeah, accuracy is medium. So th this is another another point where evade is going to be. And has King Killer, so it's another reason to put yeah. uh, uh, evade on your flag. Yeah, range high with a short minimum range. Interesting. So, yeah, uh, yeah, that's a good point. Uh, have an arc or circle so you can see the range. Yeah, because if they all have this sort of white marker above them, that means that you can see their range. All right, let's move forward. All right, okay. Scourge Chain Gun, accuracy high, range low. So this means this is another way to get in there and That's cause damage. Again. Oh, yeah, because yeah, it's got accuracy. You know, yeah. anything that has accuracy is going to be king killer, except for last, you know, uh, two months ago. I mean, I, it's just the damage imbalance is going to be freaking annoying. That's all. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it's it's screaming. You need to put a vade on your flagship once we actually get it. So we can move forward. Yeah, here we go. Last one should be. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And this one, the picture of it, it's actually a corrosive turret. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? Yeah, it's it's sort of like they run out of assets to use, and it's just what it is. Um, it's a thrower, so it has no accuracy. Potentially, you can outrun it. Um, but the yeah, range generally you can medium. kite these, can't you? Normally, or, or or you hit them from the back, one of yeah. the two. If it's if yeah. it's uh, yeah, is it, does it say it's got an angle? Throw, throw it no, it doesn't or, say uh, if it's directional or it not. Probably is. But... Well, we'll double check when it comes when the VXP target comes out. But um, yeah, yeah, wouldn't surprise me if it wasn't one that's got an arc fire. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling like this one is direction, you know, like a you know, a 45 degree arc aimed at some sort of choke point of the target. So all right, let's move forward. All right. Um, Scourge Towers. These rises from the water in an attempt to create more difficult path for its enemy. Some targets it may be possible to utilize these with a primal railgun uh, to reach other turrets through pierce. So you can fire at these, but just choose the right angle to fire at them. And then maybe, the, you know, in behind, pierce. Yeah. 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 Pierce provides you additional. Uh, it's sort of like splash, but it's directional. Um, yeah. You know, it, it continues it, the same path and, and goes through. 
and it's five and a half quarter tiles basically which is a lot you know? and it seemed to have like a 10 or like a 12.5 to 15 percent arc behind it like where it does the damage mm -hmm. or 10 percent. you know it feels like there's an arc behind it but somewhere around there it's not like it's not like splash where it does everything in 360 it's like a you know i'm gonna go with 12 and a half i, I don't know a uh, better number but that's uh that's how those work and until we see this whole target on friday you know who knows if you're unsure the distance if anybody's out there thinking what, what does that pierce look like that's like having um a three channel you know a three a three water gap channel and it's you know you fire from the outside and it goes right across the channel and fires on the opposite side of the channel and hits the turrets or stuff so it is quite a good distance okay uh, 107 is a lot well let's move forward because this one's interesting all right the reaver fuel silos on death deals a large amount of damage to nearby enemies so they have basically gas tanks mm. that do damage to them but not to us which yeah. is sort of you know the physics behind it i'm not quite certain of we'll see it's um that's a nice little twist because it's called a friendly building well it's yeah it's a uh, cluster munition basically isn't it yeah, but if you think about it, if, they have, if there's a you know a fuel tank and it blows up, it should do damage, especially if it's their one, theirs. It should do damage to both sides. You know, right. if you're using, you know. Yeah, I mean, this is all scourge, and that's a legion fuel tank. Oh, well, yeah, so it's interesting. Yeah, that's a legion picture. So. Yeah. Why is it? Why is it in an had... enemy? Yeah, why is it an enemy? Yeah, I don't know. Defense. Yeah, I don't get it. But um, anyway, the, the, the concept's fine. And I'm sure they'll be, you'll be able to utilize them, I'm sure. Um, but two siege razors, we had these things. True. But they did damage to us as well. They did damage to both sides. And it's called a friendly building. So I'm assuming we're going to have to figure it out on VXP weekend. But it, it doesn't say it does damage to everybody. No. It's called a friendly building deals a large damage well just enemies yeah, but... it says so whether you have to hit this with a rail gun and then obviously take somebody that behind I mean, it doesn't say what's the health low damage high splash is medium or well, that's, un that's un that doesn't describe anything yet you know yeah. i'd rather have a number and never splash because then that would give us a you know it sat on a a single a one tile width yeah island so it gives an indication of obviously then I'm guessing it's going to be 40 or 50, but I, I don't know. Yeah. All right, let's move forward. We'll see. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, that's, that's the way it described. Yeah. Um, no, you, you can go for it. I was just talking to Fred. All right, the 528 is the new target uh, for a little over 2 million points. 2 million points, yeah. It's getting a bit silly and, on points again. And it's uh, much easier than the 516, as I explained earlier. We're going to have uh, TSM run through it. Uh, and then, potentially, if we uh, still want to keep on doing the show, we'll go through the... Uh, it's much easier than the 516. We'll have Fred run through it, who's convinced he can't do these kind of targets with mixed fleets. So, and refuses to do them. So we'll give that a shot. Yeah, although I do think it's more a case of his his hardware makes it difficult for him to do these targets. But we'll see. Well, yeah, we're all getting older, and our hardware doesn't work the same way it used to. But uh, <laughs> yeah, the uh, I, I still think he can do it. Um, do you want to yeah. do you want to hit the target now, or do you want to? Uh, yeah, don't worry. We can we can switch. Fine, ready. So. Um, and I haven't even started FM yet, or look, even looked at the target, so it'll be going in raw, which is which is good sometimes, isn't it? So, well, you know, you got to ask Fred on that. <laughs> but uh... <laughs> let's uh, share screen window that one there. Okay, should be there now. All right, I'm gonna put you on full screen. Okay. All right, you're gonna want to go. You're you're gonna want to go in at about four thirty once you find a five twenty eight. 
And you're going to find this is a very simple target. There's... All right, so it's a, it's a yeah, I've got it. So there's one there. So in about four ish, you reckon? Yeah, yeah. Going around four, and then you're going to find the uh, the missile, uh, the copper tone missile. Okay, yeah. Second, and backups too. Okay, so yeah, I can see this one there. One there. All right. Okay. Yeah, it's it's. They've given you a path, um, a pretty good path to get this all done. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Just just close up on that one, and you're gonna want to. You're headed. Uh, I go uh, clockwise. You go clockwise, yeah, because I mean it almost indicates you to go up to that cat measure up there. But then again, you can come down here. So I can go that way, pick up that, pick up that. I don't know. I've run through it like five times the other way and don't take any damage. Well, let's just make it interesting. and We'll try this way and then we'll go the other way next time. So, And you reckon the, um, the, the warning... Because, is... because before I was using that, that missile on the other side and that chain's over. Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, see what happened? Yeah. It's what the good. hell happened there? Yeah, you're in the range of two, so maybe you should listen to me. I'm just kidding. But yeah, yeah. You you got in range of two of the long range uh rockets. But and it didn't overwhelmed fire. your triaries. But it didn't fire at the same time because the other one didn't even show a circle. Yeah, well. I don't know. So hang on, what's the range of that one there? So it's there. Oh, so you can still do this one, you just gotta come in lower. Yeah, you can still do it. Yeah. I'm just saying my way was easier, but yeah. Well, yeah, but, you know, we can't just all copy, can we? Okay. Yeah, because you can, what's getting chewed on right now, you can hit it from that side and not even come close to them. So. All right. Since you're doing this one rogue, I'm... I'm going to go rogue. I'm going to go rogue. I'm, I'm interested in the ships at the moment because they're moving this time, so... Yeah, they're moving this time. As long as you don't let them get too close to you, you want to... You want to. You don't need to kite them, kite them, but you don't want them to overcome your projectile speed on your gales. I've only got nine gales as well. Okay. Yeah, I have 12 on my fleet. I like the fact that ships are moving now. You like it? Yeah. Well, it makes it more interesting, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll let you run through this once, and then we bring in Fred. Fred will do it for zero damage. Yeah, yeah, why not? Yeah, that'd be good. So that one well, mistake... Well, you went is... rogue. Well, it's only that one thing. Yeah, that no, one mistake is going to be like a half an hour damage, at that least. doesn't matter. No, uh, but, you know, if you want to run through them for all for instant repair... Doesn't well, so long as you do the whole FM about dying, that's all that matters, isn't it, to be honest? Uh, that's awkward because that's still got a bit of, yet, a bit of that one there. Should have clocked the uh, angle of that one there because you can still get into there. Anyway, not to worry. Where's this one? There he is there. So. That's like that one there. So as long as only two ships are firing, your nine gales is enough. Any more than that, you get in a real yeah. Mess, you, you don't, you don't, yeah. Like I said, I have twelve MDS threes and no um um or get no. I'm sorry, uh, twelve gale fours and no MDS threes and take no damage. Fred, do you, do you want to put it together a, a fleet that has that? Uh, well, not many people have those, got 12, those, 12 gales, though. Normally people do or don't? Not many people do. Okay. 
Maybe I've got one uh, 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 Yeah, I, I went with uh, a different haul for Gales and MDS threes, but with the different specials. So. All right, gotcha. Yeah, oh, I see. You put all the MDS threes on one because you're a different special for it. Yeah, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I went mean, shaft splitter versus. You know, yeah, yeah, makes sense. Yeah, so that one's on the outside. See, so, yeah, but you can get that one. Not they really can't. Yeah. So where's this one here? It's there. So I'm intrigued to see if you can get to that without that, because that will make life a little bit more difficult. Nope. Yep, we can do it that way. Would have been better to come in the top because yeah, you can do that one and then you can do that one. No, I, I don't know. Your choice, but yeah. No, no, I'm just saying if you went anti clockwise, it could have been that one and that one, and then it could have been that one and that one. Okay. Hey, one mistake. Costly, but one mistake. Because I got the mobile apps being full. I think it will damage the attacker. What Fred said. What was that? Oh, that's about the raid stuff. Okay. Yeah, it's just that one one turret. Yeah. So we'll get yeah. Bloody hell, that one turret. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm saying. Still doable so, though. It's just like just don't need to make sure make sure you just don't cross two paths, like you said. Yeah. So Fred, do you, do you want to run through this? Yeah, Ligo, you, you just need two. There's two in there, the, mate. Sorry. Yeah, two. two those are the damage dealers. Hang on, let me just go back and I'll show you. So I yeah, should have shown you. Should, should have shown uh, you Ligo, first. yeah, you, you just need to have somewhere between uh, 12 and. Um, one second, I'm uh, sending. Yeah, so at the moment, then, so that's the full damage arc as ever. Nothing's changed there. Um, so I've got two full damage arcs, and then I've got three. Troyari ships, um, and, and I haven't changed. I must admit, it's just this target doesn't clearly doesn't need MDS threes, but this this one I had already built. So, and I've and I've got the specials, the same specials as what you have on when we had on the arc. So it's got a massive amount of projectile speed. I think it's at two hundred and ten or something stupid. Yeah, two hundred and ten projectile speeds on these ones. Yeah, so I'm, for, getting for... With, I'm getting away with nine gales. Unless I cross okay. paths with two ships. <laughs> uh, 12 game. But you, you don't need any MDS3s. I sent you an invite, Fred. I'll do another one quickly, just uh, while I'll wait. Well, I'll do one in the background. If Fred's on, then we can cut me out. and then. Yeah. Yeah, so I've got three Gales legal on each and, and one MDS3. So with the... Um, the system I've got at the moment is not too bad. I do like the fact that ships move. That's more interesting. It's probably more interesting. Yeah, and the ships take way more damage, uh, or they have way less health than the turrets. So you can load up on the turrets if you time it right and wipe mm. them all out. Uh, Yeah, definitely. Uh, no. Um, uh, well, before we talked about uh, 
should I remove the MDS threes? I, I don't know what changes they're going to make. What I, I end up, I, yeah, I, what I ended up doing, I mean, with this current TLC, uh, you're going to have plenty of build tokens, but I put uh, four on my Treyarchs. I put four uh, Gales on three ships, and then I put two MDS threes on another, and the other one was full damage. Which makes sense because of the different types of. Uh... Yeah, yeah, because you want to use uh, shaft splitter on yeah. the uh, on the, yeah, um, MDSs. the uh, yeah. yeah, and then Batorius on the other ones. So. Yeah. Mm. See, I like this because then they, I like the fact the ships can't, you can position yourself, and while you're waiting for those damn stupid turrets to fire, then you can actually. Um, Yeah, I quite like it. You can do a bit of damage as well to the turrets. Come on, fire once more. Thank you very much. Hey, Fred, how are you doing? <clears throat> Fine, thank you. Hey, buddy. Have you toned down those fires yet or no? I'm sorry, what was that? Have you toned down those fires up there yet? Not yet. Okay. Not in my job description. Okay. All right. <laughs> You drink some more beer, just go pee out in the woods. It'll stop them. I'm not sure that's true. <laughs> well, yes. Yeah. No, I'm just making up stories at this point. But, Fred, if you want to uh, get ready with something that has like around. I, I, have, 12 I, have, a fleet, I have a fleet note already. Mm -hmm. Well, if you want to start screen sharing, and I'll, uh, I'll do the not hard to drive uh easy way to do it this is easy now just don't cross over those two first ones and now it's now it's a piece of cake yeah if anything my problem may be <clears throat> excuse me trying to nudge up to the to the um, you know the UAV turrets or the no, uh, no, no, no. You, you don't even need to do that this time. Okay, okay, all right. Then I won't even worry about it until until I do it. Okay. Until you yeah. did. Let's let's do that. Let's. Uh, yeah, let's, no, no, let's no, just, no, because it's okay. It's nope, fairly easy. They, they've given you very easy access okay. points. Um, okay, when we'll see when I do it. Okay. Yeah, the only thing is to not rush these long range turrets. Mm, yeah. Because and, you know, no, no, you, this, can't, you can't rush them, no. You used to be able to with a raid, yeah. but you can't anymore. And you notice that even now, I've gone the other way around, because I've now highlighted that one there, you can squeeze through, there's a massive gap, so. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I couldn't do shit in a raid, so don't, don't, don't even, I don't even worry about rushing things, so I couldn't, I couldn't do a 103. Okay. Well, get ready to screen share. Um, I'm, well, I'm, I'm ready when I'm ready, I guess. Well, uh, you haven't screen shared, so I can't. Oh, well, do I have to? Oh, do I have to? Oh, mm -hmm. I didn't know I had. To, I didn't know we could do two screens at the same time. Yeah, yeah. Well, we can't, but I I can select you. Oh, well, okay. I got you. I got you. Okay. Yeah. All right. So we for TSM to finish up this target. There we go. Yeah. yeah, you're taking the trickier driving route. Yeah, yeah. I'm just obstinate, as you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I think you're right. Anti-clockwise, it looks like the, the, the target is set up to come in anti-clockwise. No, cl cl clockwise. Uh, clockwise. Yeah, but I also think you can probably come in at 11 o'clock and start there. And then go yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll have Fred go through it. Fred I'll do another one think... while I'm waiting. I'll do another one. And I'll okay. start. Because Fred doesn't think he can do this. So I well, didn't I'll say do... I couldn't do it. Well, you could do it on the on the raid ones. Well, you refused. That, was, that, that was a 103. Yeah. yeah well, totally well, well, different well, target. Than this. I know. Uh, uh, we'll, we'll run through it. That's what I'm saying. We're just that, was, that was in Palers, not, uh, yeah. not this. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we can go back to that, but yeah. There we go. All well, right. Uh, are you still? We're done here. So that should be damage free, hopefully. Yep. Completely. 
So while you're watching, Fred, I'm going to try one at, go at 11 o'clock, but also going um, clockwise, as you said. Let's see what that's about. All right. Um, Fred, you want to go full screen? You're, you're presented at this point? Uh, where am I at here? Jeez, I can't see a freaking thing here. Hang on. Uh, oh, you mean in my... In your game, yeah, go for the oh, screen. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, go for the screen. Yeah, there we go. Okay. All right. And then now go. Yep, you're you're good now. And so yeah, go see, and I, 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 st I still have the same issue I had last time with those two gray bars down the side. <clears throat> but anyway, okay, where is a. What I'm looking for? 528, mate. So we've only really got CICs. Everyone should have enough armor now in the FM if you if you've been collecting. So yeah, uh, yeah. All right, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Enter about there. That's that's a good spot. Maybe a little bit higher, but uh, a little bit closer to four. Yeah, but but that's that's gonna be fine. I don't think it makes that much difference, does it? I mean, it's just close. Yeah, just how quick. I just how quick. Okay, it's all it's, it's all good. All right, let's see what happens. Wait, you have... Okay, that's a different... Okay. It shows up as three rampages, but I'm assuming that's not what's going on here. And you have how many um, gales? You should have 12. Okay. You should have three fours. It's got the full Monty. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Fred Full Monty. All right. <laughs> All right. So just edge up on that. Uh, this guy right here. Right. Yeah, just edge up and just kite him, and yeah. he should be in good shape. Stop. I already did. Bit of in game lag there. There we go. This ain't my first rodeo. <laughs> All right, take a left. All right, take a left. I knew you were going to say that. I just knew that was coming. All right, and then do the same thing with this. Uh... What about the ships coming? Yeah. I mean, okay. it's no, yeah. I, I mean, you, I mean, you could wait. You could wait, but they're no, easy I, to take. They're easy to take out later. But just stop. You know. No, no, no. I just just didn't want to run in them. Mm -hmm. Well, you sort of do because as long as you don't, they don't get too close. You can take them out. Um, so, so, so I've noticed could, you can use those already. When the ships come close, then you AV them. Then, they'll, then is it, there you go. Yeah. yeah so yeah, don't start there, hitting there them until the ships are close. I got you. Yeah, I got you. Oh, oh yeah, well, all, was... all right. Keep on going left. That was, that was pretty impressive. It's nice when that happens, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Keep on going left, and then aim. Get, you're gonna have to stop, but keep on going over the direction you're going. Keep on going. Keep on going. Keep on going. All right. Uh, aim towards that countermeasure, and then stop when you get right the. Uh, yeah, aim for that. Um. There we go. Stop. I'll get close enough to take that one. There we go. So I actually think, yeah, you can do this target with just triaries because of those single turrets that you can use for kiting the... Um... Oh, that penalty won't be able to... You can drive by the right. ships over triaries, can't you? All right, go, oh, go left. Go left, Fred. All right, you don't want to get in the range of the big bad boy. Because they hurt. Okay, this guy. Okay, so follow him along so you... Yeah. Okay, you're a good spot. All right. So aim for the countermeasure, but yeah. stop stop when you get the telegraph oh, yeah. load. Yeah. Okay. Normal, normal procedure. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. Yes. There we go. 
See, I'm getting a, I'm getting a really good gap here where where I haven't in the past. Yeah, it seems well, good, isn't it? Yeah. It's a it's yeah. a huge gap. Where you know other times, I had to be almost inside the target, mm -hmm. <clears> or <throat> the turret. Okay. All right. Keep What's on next? moving. Uh, go north a bit, and then you're going to want to come back down um, on that countermeasure. Target this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. But you're going to need to stop before you oh, get there. Yeah, but do you want me to go high or just come right across? Oh, uh, just get you up. Know, just go, go a little high because you don't want them. Yeah, these guys. I have, I have the ships too. Okay, I see. Yeah, no, yeah, they okay. turn, so it should be okay. Yeah, yeah. So stop. There we go. All right, you can go north. We'll, we'll come back and get these ships. Go north and then come around, and then we're gonna we're gonna take out these ships that go back and forth. You don't want them to get that close to you. So once they come back, you're, you're gonna want to take them out before. Yeah, I just I just want to see where they come to, and then I can know where I want to yeah. go. Yeah, oh, and also take a look at the the long range rocket as far as where they are, but because you're going to want to close on, because you're going to need to hit them a few times. Yeah. Okay, so you can close on. You can close yeah, on okay. that. So I can get the lead. I can get the lead guy next time. Then yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's the guy I can get first. This guy here. Yeah, and then they'll chain all over. Yeah, if I can just get him and even even turn away. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I'm doing one on auto now. See what it's like. There we go. Uh, uh, from what I heard, not not going to work out well. No, I don't think it will work out well. But I just have interest, just just because Nobby's always going to want to ask. Yeah. Yeah. Crack Crack and Doc told me it took him like seven hours of damage. Okay. Yeah, that doesn't. That seems about right. But I think it might have moved. Is that dry Ares or, or a combi fleet? I didn't say. He just said he autoed it and hated the target, and then I sent him back. I'm like, oh, I got zero damage driving it. And he's like, yeah, okay, whatever. See, I'd be happier taking these guys from a lower side. No, but, but, but you can get it. Just stay out. No, of no, I, I understand I can, but right now. Okay, I'm, okay, okay. You can close right on now, uh, you can Yeah, you I know, but I'm waiting, for the, I'm waiting for this guy to get to me, and I'm probably <coughs> too late. Going there, whereas I was coming from okay, if I was okay. coming from the bottom, okay. I get him okay. from the side. Okay, Fred. The only thing you need to be afraid of with these guys not afraid is... of anything. Okay, whatever. It's Fred. a fucking okay. pixel game. I would okay. go down. Yeah, while they're moving, I'd come in but, from but, but down the there. But the only thing, the only thing you need to be wary of is is that the big rocket. So you can. I understand you, that, but no, you also have to be wary of getting fired on by by three ships. No, not with 12 rockets. Or not with 12 uh, gales. Oh, so, so you think yeah. I can just sit in there and... and yeah, 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 and no, all, all, three of them can, all three of them can fire you with 12 gales. Oh, okay. You just, you, can't, you, 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 you just okay. can't run them over. You can't run them okay, over. Okay, no, no, no. You didn't say that. Yeah. But see, I'd so. still be happier just taking this guy from the side. That would be much better. But anyway, I... I, I yeah. Jesus, anyway, it's made anyway. eight million points for the freaking CIC. Holy hell! Okay. Yeah, but that's nothing. It's all relative, uh, right? It's full uh, targets. It is. All right, all right. Just aim for I the mean, counter. I mean, don't, don't forget, you know, you get two million points for okay. this target. Uh, just aim for the countermeasure. Oh, you, 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 uh, where this guy right here? No, 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 no. The Where's one above it. The one above it. Oh, this guy, the guy in the middle. No, no, the countermeasure. The, 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 Hang on, let me get rid of him first. Okay, to the right, to the right, to the right, the other right. There we go, that one. Able oh, that guy, one. okay. Well, yeah, I can do that. There's only okay. one right, not another right. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> Your other right. Okay. <laughs> That's funny. It's a bit of a little naughty, guys. <laughs> yeah, I mean, obviously, I, I, you know, I should be able to do this 
wants to get, you know, wants to be able to do this better, faster than, than you know, nine minutes or ten minutes, whatever it's going to take. <clears throat> but it, it takes me about five minutes, but yeah, yeah no, yeah, and I, and yeah, now that I muscle seen, memory repetition. Yeah, no, now yeah. that I've seen a path, and I, I might modify it slightly okay. for that. So, 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 aim to the countermeasure, just edge. I might count modify out slightly for that for those three ships I just did, but other than Let's that, it, it looks very, obviously, very doable. Very enjoyable way. Eh? It's actually quite a good target. I quite like it. I like there's a, there's movement in it, and you know it's. There's different routes you can take. You know, there's damage that you can take. Obviously, if you end up driving like an how did you take damage? It looks like you're taking some damage. I, I did because I uh, I uh, when I was stopping my fleet, my hand touched the mouse pad, which okay. moved my fleet. All right, so yeah. just click click that one and. Should be it. Kill, uh, yeah. Should be you know, a laptop, Fred. Are you? Oh yeah. All yeah. right. Have you got a mouse? Mouse? Have you? I do have a mouse. Mouse. Yeah, I have a real so mouse. So I there's a button somewhere on your. Oh no no! I, I had the thing. I had the the, uh, the thing uh, disabled, uh, 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 and then and then on the weekend I put some RAM in. Uh, oh all right. Okay. And when I brought it into the the nerds, it, it reset. He, so uh, he was trying to figure out because I didn't. I didn't bring a mouse or anything with it. He was trying to figure out what to do. And then I said, oh, you got to do this. You gotta hit yeah. hit yeah. this ring three times, and then I forgot to turn it off. Yeah, because like, then it's like two okay. months. Back, uh, uh, back uh, right. Oh, there it is. Oh, sorry. I didn't know I had another turret there. I was wondering why my yeah, clock yeah. hadn't stopped. Yeah. So this, and then you should be done. I'll have to target. Oh, uh, mm, okay. Oh no! No, they're firing at you. Uh, no, because I I actually selected it. I actually targeted it. I didn't. You should get out range of your tire tire then. Should be able to. What are you saying about me? Hey, Nobby, <laughs> Auto King. All right, yeah, twelve minutes, but yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Th th there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, everything yeah. does not I, have to be zero. I'm I'm fine with that. Good. Okay. No, I think Lovely. it's a good target. I like it. Yeah. So now now I know what to do, and it's it's uh, it's going to be very simple. Yeah, it's okay, yeah. isn't it? But I am surprised. Mm -hmm. uh, capital S that they're still allowing a mixed fleet. I concur. Yeah. And uh, you know maybe allowing is not the correct word, but um, encouraging. To be honest, well, it is almost encouraging yeah. now. Yeah, it's almost okay, that speed. I'm going to uh, leave here. Okay. Well, you, right, yeah. you have no no further need for me. I'm, I'm guessing. All right, I'm <laughs> going to put you back on uh, TSM. Oh, I'm just yeah. I'm still. I, I that was five hours or something. That was by the way. Damage. Oh, for the, oh, for the auto. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it was a, well, it's still a lot, isn't it? The fleet's half dead. I don't know. Half, half a fleet practically just to auto one target. Yeah, don't do that. It's not wise. No, especially that target. Yeah. Yeah, there's no. Yeah, but I mean, I mean the you, 516, you, you're going to get, you know, you, what, you 40, 40 minutes to, to an hour or something. Yeah. Yeah, there's no point, is there? So, and this won't be worth two million points after a while. So, yeah. Points no, for damage all, wise. Uh, the ordering, it's definitely not the way ahead. Yeah, I mean, but this. Nobby, don't do it, mate. <laughs> Navi will do it. Navi be all over that. Be all over that like friggin' white on rice. Well, that was fun. I'm just, I'm just wondering, you know, why, why have a flagship if we're only using these trieries as a combination fleet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, uh, I don't get it. That's what I'm completely confused by. I am like, why are they doing this? I mean, I, I, I like the target combination. I like the way it. I mean, yeah, I, I do. yeah, it's fun. It's it's fun to figure out these targets, but it's like, also nice to be encouraged to have a combination fleet because we've been so stovepiped on. It must be this. It must be that. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, I really but, the, like it. But, but my thought on this is that this is not. Uh, this is not. Uh, you know, this shouldn't be designed this way. 
No, no. Because why? Well, because you want to get fucked over as a player? No, no. Because when you when you have a uh, when you when you have a uh, a new ship, the targets are made for the new ship, not for a combination of. I mean, like we don't have we don't have a target that has you know you know three impalers and two whatever. But we used to. We used to have tar- yeah, targets yeah, yeah. like that. Oh we yeah, no, a, that was a, that was a, yeah. Oh yeah, yes, you did because you could have the you could have the uh, uh, the uh, the citadel and the uh, yeah, exactly. The, uh, other, uh, the other the other guy for your for your tank. You, yes, you used to do that, but they haven't done that for ages. No, it's, it's predominantly in uh, PvP now, isn't it? So. Yes. Yeah, I, I mean, you used to be able to use MCXs if you just, you know, I had multiple fleets of MCXs. No, 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 you did, because remember, you you had the, uh, I forget what the flagship was, but it, it just sat a, a, a thousand miles away and gave everybody else extra. Oh, you're color. talking about the Kodiak, but the Kodiak. yeah. Kodiak. The Highlander. Yeah, yeah, but, but yeah. the MCX, yeah, there was like, it was fun. It was fun to have the no, ability no, no, no. to be I, I, like, not, figure I, no, things out. But, so, yeah, you could do that, but they haven't done that for ages. And and right, so you're it, fighting against them bringing it back? No, I'm not fighting against anything. I I just I'm uh, I'm very suspect of their. Yeah, motives. I don't think they're bringing it back. I just think this is a. I think I just think that they fucked up and and they haven't. No, no, I, I I agree with that. I I don't think. Th- I've not seen any signs that they realize that this is what they're doing, but you know, I think what happened with the, with the raid, they should have been quite aware of what the player base was doing uh, with mixing the fleets and whatnot. And what I've seen with this target, they've not they've not reacted in a negative way associated with no, them. not at all, no. And so therefore, I'm like, they feel like this is a cool thing at this point. But like I said. I also feel like it's a trap. I also feel like, oh, they're gonna, they're gonna change this on. That's why I encourage everybody get the new well, rocket. It's only a trap if you don't continue to to improve plan. the yeah the to, 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 to the trap. Yeah, you gotta keep keep on improving. Right, your you gotta Ferrari you, know, you gotta do if, case, if there's you know you have the limited weapon. You do what you normally do. You put you put all yeah. limited weapons on. If they come yeah. up with a was well, they're not going to have a CIC, but if they did, you would put that on. If they come up with a with a new a new loader, you put that on. <laughs> Look at Lego. Maybe they like the arcs too much too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I mean, <laughs> thanks, Lego. I, I, I like that. I, I, yeah, yeah. I mean, the arcs were a lot of fun, and they they continue to be more fun than they were before. I mean, yeah. because now, because That's now right. you got the Terraris like blocking out the rockets, so they're way more fun than they were but, before. Yeah, but still they're not as much for fun. Year now. But still not as much fun year. as as the lionfish. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, I mean, there. I'm starting to wonder with your last comment if you're the reason. There's, you know, that you have the. Uh, Fifth, fifth least populated uh, time zone in the world. I'm wondering if I used <laughs> two arcs and three lionfish, what would happen? <laughs> a little <a> repair. <laughs> You've still got some lionfish? No way. Oh, no, no. They were, they long they were, gone. They were scrapped the first chance I, I could. Do you want these last couple of slides, Neffy? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. I'm on present, so. Uh, I like that. I like that target. I like that yeah, path. Me too. Uh, yeah. I can certainly. I mean, again, you know, I, I know I'm very happy with with 12 minutes. Uh, well, the point is, you know, I've just done four, just as we've been talking now, and that's four more, and you're done. You've got enough leftover points to go and get all everything else. So, oh yeah, because again, you, you know, Eight you, know, you don't it. need anything else. I, and I'm not, I'm not speaking for everyone. I'm speaking for 97.3 percent of everyone. Who who only needs the two CICs? Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. And anyone else who doesn't who needs more, then it's your fault for leaving and coming back after seven years. 
There you go, there's Hefe's run. Just thought we'd put it up there because he, he feels very proud of that. <laughs> no, I, I, it was my first run, as you see. Yeah, it was zero damage. All right. No, uh, because I, I saw I saw what you posted on Discord, and I said, well, you know, this I got to see. And yeah, I not yeah. only saw it, I actually experienced it firsthand. Yeah. So, well done. All right, the f Furious Momentum CIC. Yeah. So, uh, looks like it a looks dodgy like ship. ship. It looks yeah, like a ship. Exactly. Yeah. 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 yeah see, that I always looks... like Reva stuff. Reva stuff's great. Right? Yeah. yeah. Cool. See, that cool. looks like a uh, that looks like uh, a rampage. Yeah. A squished up one. Yeah. 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 yeah it's good though. Good well, idea. TSM and I had eight fleets of Ebzex were different. Between the two of you, I had yeah, like we did. We had loads of them. Yeah, well, well, between the two of you, each one of you didn't have eight fleets. No, no, we had lots. Like, yeah, yeah. That was the days where you, but you had different ones. Don't forget, because back then you could have a prep fleet and then you could have a hit mm -hmm. fleet, and you know, someone going prep for you and, and that sort of stuff. That something, when... something that you were going to hit, you know, uh, raid targets with at the same time. Yeah, you had different, and that was no, fun. You, I, I love um, that. You used to go in there, and obviously people were defending. So you take the defender out, and then you have another one. And so you needed a ship, a ship killer fleet, and then you'd have another prep fleet and that stuff, and then you'd have another fleet for base hitting, and then one of them was dead. So you'd have another fleet ready to go again to go straight back out and be annoying and unblock another base. So I used to have two, two fleet killers, one prep fleet, and then a base killing fleet. It was yeah, that was what I used to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I love the MCX and I love mm. the Sea Wolf. Those are those are my two favorite of all time. Yeah. Uh, as far as just the the functionality, you know, because I had a the Thud Four Sea Wolves, and then I had yeah, I had you know, and the different versions of uh, other I stuff. I still think my favorite was DNX's though. DNX's was a big uh, yeah, the, the Black Rain. <laughs> yeah, it was hysterical. Black Rain. Yeah. Yeah, that was that was just, that was just awesome. Yeah, I, I, when I won the one point where I won the contest that they had. Uh, remember back in the day where they had contests where like, what what do you want? And you know, like, uh, mine was like, what music do you listen to uh, when you're playing uh, battle pirates? Mm, yeah. And I made it all battle pirates related, and they like, you know, they had me be the winner. Yeah, the little competitions. And, I remember that. Yeah. Yeah, that was fun. I mean, I, I think that yeah. was a. I think that was a. You know, a good thing. Some of them got too high. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. it was a good sideline, but I thought it was fun. Um, you know, some of them got you know, like photoshopping this and photoshopping that. That was that was a real good was not, People were pretty good at doing some stuff. I must admit. Yeah, yeah, it, it was really interesting to watch. I thought it was. I thought it was positive to put people forward as far as like, oh, okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to. And I think they created things that were. You know, I think they got a good impression of what the community was like, and I, I, I liked it. Um, I didn't clock that, Hefe, at the bottom there. The speed up and a stack of five. I didn't clock that. That's going to make it a super fast fleet. Yeah, we're going to get a 15% increase. Yeah. Yeah. So that's going to make this a very, probably our fastest fleet we've had. Um, for some time then if you're up to 138 which i think we were on that bill we were talking about and then you add 15 percent to the base that's going to be quite a fast ship i I, 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 I I didn't like the interdictors honestly they go that's not that wasn't one of my things so that was that weird no with the interdictors that weird fleet that was only pvp uh for certain targets is that what I'm thinking about with the interdictors, or was the interdictors a skirmish fleet? Uh, whatever. Um, the furious momentum CIC. Yeah, it's uh, uh, the ballistic damage and building damage only apply to the ship that it's on, but the plus three combat and turn speed is an aura that applies, you know, once you get them on all five ships, gets you up to 
I'm really pleased I didn't just open up the two-day chest because on the Elite, I just got two two-day chests. That's a, that's a nice change. Yeah. Instead of... Yeah. Uh, I didn't get the seven day, but I got a, I got two two days. So that's, that's nice. Yeah, I uh, nice. yeah always 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 open up the. Oh, oh okay okay. Well, yeah. The the inter- first. yeah, they were black and they looked like a uh, yeah. The interdictors were yeah yeah I I remember them. That was like tier seven or whatever. That was a long time ago. I do recall those. Um, so yeah, they're eight eight million each. May seem like a ton of points. But at the end of the day, it really doesn't eight matter. Targets. It's the number of targets, isn't it? And that's eight. Yeah, it's yeah. To do the whole yeah. thing. So it's four targets. Okay. Yeah, but you need twice. So, yeah. It's, um... No, but it's, it's four targets. The last CIC was yeah. four targets. Yeah, it's fine. And they were like, you know, they were like, whatever, you know. But the points for those targets were like 300,000 or something. And... Uh, and the CIC was 1.2 million. Uh, I, do, I do think they should knock off three noughts now on the points required thing, just put it down to 8K and, you know. Well, they could do that, yeah. But again, it's it's all, it's, it's all, it's all relative, right? It's, it's the same. Yeah. If, if you take, if you take a zero off the price, you take a zero off the number of points, yeah. and you're still in the exact same place. You still have to do four targets. Yeah, it's just enough to see. I never just quite understand why they have to show it in millions. Why can't it just be like? Um, I just, I, I just think <laughs> it's just, it's like, uh, I think that just like, uh, I don't know, it's just, it may just be a show off thing or something. I'm not really sure. I don't you know, know what or, it is. Or, yeah. or, you know, it's like it, 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 it may, they're trying to show some um, sort of, you know, incremental improvement in the game or something but it's not because i mean know. look at the armor points on your outpost yeah you know it, it, it's, <laughs> it's it's crazy they can knock six noughts off that and it still be functional with it's just yeah or at least right but then it. but then they would have they would have to they would have to knock down the damage of everything. the attackers yeah uh, but it's got to the stage where now it's just mental it's just oh no it is it, it is it is uh ludicrous numbers Oh yeah, it, 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 yeah. I mean, it is because I, I think you mentioned that a couple of months ago when when that first happened, and you were talking about the damage of something, and we were into the billions then. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, eventually they'll they'll have to, you know, you know, because they're going to run out of zeros <laughs> or uh, space on the screen. They're, they're going to run out of space in the in the box to put. Your, your your damage, you know, or, or whatever. So they'll they'll have to do they'll have to come up, almost almost like almost like they do with a with a a stock and they they do a stock split, and they yes. and then yeah. and then you know, then then the value gets goes to half, but you get twice as many shares. Mm-hmm. This this will this will be something similar to that. So. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Anyway, anyway. Right, we're done. I think. We're done. Okay. Uh, uh, all right. We're all from different countries. Uh, I'm trying to figure out. Uh, I mean, uh, Fred, do you watch any stuff on streaming? Uh, very little. Uh, yeah, so sorry. Let me let me rephrase that. You're talking what kind of streaming? I'm I'm not including porn. I'm okay, more about. Let, let, okay, let me tell you what I have, <laughs> and it's all streaming. I have a Fire Stick for my. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. yeah. So it's, go so ahead, it's, go it's, ahead, it's go all, ahead. It's all streaming. Okay. I have a so Fire so, Stick so what are you what are you watching now, Fred? Right now I'm watching the Furious Momentum CIC. No, no, no. <laughs> but, 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 but what are you watching when you're watching? You understand what I'm saying, Fred? I well, to be honest with you, I have like eight thousand channels, and you can only watch one at a time, obviously. I know, and but I, what 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 is your favorite? Is what I'm I don't saying. have favorites. So I don't watch I, I, TV. I, 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 I watch. I watch. I'm not your favorite. I watch very little TV. I watch YouTube mostly. I do. I do as well. I'll do some YouTube stuff, but I watch very little TV. Most TV that I will watch uh, will be sports and the odd bit of, call it, you know, 
public affairs or whatever, but the news, yeah, the news stuff. I can't even watch that because it's mostly garbage. Okay. The uh, you know whatever network you watch is is uh, is either hard left or hard right, and okay, it uh, yeah, so it's not news anymore. Anyway, that's just my humble opinion. Okay, go go ahead. But 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 what do you like? Yeah, I, I have I have watched Tubi, Lego. Um, hey, hey, I I watch what I watch in Tubi is Miami Vice. To be honest, oh, fuck. What? <laughs> you get that upset? Maybe Miami, Miami Vice. Book of Miami Vice from like book 1989. Book him, Dan. Book him, Dan. Over to one. You can uh, watch that on freaking a really old freaking streaming channel. I'm sure. Oh yeah, I can. I can watch that on my Fire Stick. Yeah, you know, I can desperate. watch. I can watch friggin' uh, I Love Lucy. I Magnum PI. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, uh, Money Vice is way better than those shows. I think I can actually go back to black and white on my on some of my yeah. some of my TV streaming stuff. Okay. Anyway, um, no, uh, not not wanting to rock the boat, but shouldn't this be done uh, after show stuff? Yeah, we're finished. Uh, all, go. Right. all right. Go well, I'm going to invite anybody that wants to show up and figure out what actually Fred is watching. I already told you. I'm a stubble man. What does that mean? Oh, I do have stubble. You know, I do have a beard. So, uh, all right. They're, they're not helping me uh, create more content for us. So, you guys have a good time. Uh, we'll be back on Friday. We'll deal with the VXP weekend and see how that goes. Um, otherwise, we we will we'll see you then. And uh, you know, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, you know, have a good time. Good night, everyone. Take it easy. Later, people. <laughs>